Dwarfism can occur from a medical condition and also from generational evolution. Some animals that we know well in their taller statutes have smaller versions out there in pockets roaming the earth. And in today's video, we're talking about 10 unusual dwarf animals in the world. Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to The Supreme, and click the notification bell for more lit content. Let's get rolling. <laughs> Giraffe. Giraffes are among the tallest animals in the world, but did you know that in 2011, some people began thinking many giraffes were real? The wild rumor started after a TV commercial seemingly showed a tiny dog-sized giraffe and the website Petite Lap Giraffe was launched. Believers began blogging about the small genetic mutations, with some people getting excited over the possibility of owning one of the pint-sized creatures. Uh, sorry to burst everyone's bubble, but the commercial and website were part of a viral marketing campaign for DirecTV. Though I would love to own a Petite Lap Giraffe, if it were real, Speaking of dwarf giraffes, I was surprised to find this image of a short, stocky-looking creature that kind of resembles the long-necked herbivores. The animal in this image kind of looks like a cross between a giraffe, a horse, and a rhino. I think it must be the work of Photoshop, rather than a real short and chubby giraffe. What do you think? Leave us a comment on the video with the hashtag OpenDiscussion to let us know what you think is up with this animal. Pygmy Marmoset Oh my, this monkey is so small. The Pygmy Marmoset is found in the Amazon basin and has a head the size of a human thumb. This species is one of the smallest primates in the world. These cute little creatures weigh just three and a half ounces, which is nuts. They may be small, but they still have very sharp teeth and nails which are used to climb trees and bite through tree gum. Pygmy Marmosets hang around in gangs. Worryingly, the pygmy marmoset faces danger from Amazon deforestation and from the exotic pet trade. Their docile nature makes them easy to capture. Micropig Pigs have been bred to be smaller and smaller, and eventually, the micropig was born. However, the label has been deceptive and led a lot of people who have attempted to have them as pets into trouble. Regular pigs can weigh over a thousand pounds. The largest ever pig on record was 2,552 pounds. Micro pigs are pigs that will grow to the height of a small dog and weigh 250 pounds. The problem is that people think that they will make cute pets. They are under the belief that they are getting something the size and weight of a small house cat and that their pig will stay that way, but in reality, the pigs grow much bigger than they anticipate. Even a small pig can be a big pet, plus pigs aren't easy to domesticate, need a lot of food, and create a lot of mess. Pygmy Hippo Hippos are pretty big and scary, but imagine how cute they would look if they were tiny. Well, imagine no longer. Pygmy hippos are a real thing. They look like many versions of their larger relatives, but spend less time in water and are far less aggressive. This rare breed of hippo live in forests of West Africa, mainly in Liberia. They are herbivores and are reported to be shy and nocturnal. Regular hippos measure about five and a half feet tall and weigh an incredible 3,300 pounds, whereas pygmies are just three feet tall and weigh between 400 and 600 pounds, which is comparatively smaller. Because of their weight comparative to humans, pygmy hippos can still be dangerous to humans, so it's best not to attempt to hug them. Not that any sane person would try and cuddle a hippopotamus. Fun fact for you, the 30th president of the United States, President Calvin Coolidge, owned a pygmy hippo called Billy, who is the ancestor to most of the pygmy hippos in zoos across America. Pygmy Shrew I wasn't ready for this level of cuteness. I haven't really thought about regular shrews much. I don't think I've ever actually seen one. But footage of the pygmy shrew is heartwarming. They're so small and fluffy. So the pygmy shrew is one of the world's smallest mammals. I guess if you're scared of mice, these might not be for you. But shrews are a little different. 
off the bat, they're smaller and they have cute pointed noses. Their tails are less rodent-like too. They're fluffier. Pygmy shrews are the smallest mammal found across most of the world and there are a few variants in the species. The smallest is the Etruscan pygmy shrew, which grows to just 1.4 inches in body length. A fun fact about the pygmy shrew, they may look small, but they can have giant appetites. They need to eat constantly. They eat between two and three times their own body weight in a day. And they still stay tiny. Elf Owl The elf owl is a teeny tiny owl no bigger than a sparrow and is among the smallest owls in the world. Are you ready to meet the smallest owl ever? Get ready to meet Tiny, the African Scops Owl. They're just five inches long and weigh just one and a half ounces. Can you even imagine? They weigh less than a bite of a decent burger. You can find these little nippers in the southwestern United States and central Mexico, and generally they will live in holes made by woodpeckers or in holes in cacti. Regular-sized owls will eat rodents, but these tiny creatures eat insects. Elf owls will play dead if handled. Then when a predator loosens its grip, the tiny owl will make a quick getaway. Fun fact about the elf owl, unlike most wild animals, they tend to mate for life. Midget Buffalo Regular buffalo are in some ways kind of scary. They're powerful, bovine beasts stretching over six feet tall and weighing in excess of 2,000 pounds. If a buffalo has a problem with you, then you have, well, a big problem. However, on Sulawesi, a small island off Indonesia, there's a species of tiny dog-sized buffalo. These much smaller creatures are no more than two and a half feet tall and weigh around 4,000 pounds. They aren't tiny by regular standards, but they are around a quarter of the size of a regular buffalo. This species has come around as a result of island dwarfism, a phenomenon that occurs when large animals get smaller over generations in response to their habitat. Pygmy Seahorse Blink and you'll miss one of nature's smallest masters of disguise. Seahorses aren't exactly big in the first place, but the dwarves of the species are less than an inch in length and very good at camouflage. These tiny creatures live in the Indo-West Pacific Ocean and live on Gorgonian corals, which they blend into expertly. The smallest of the five varieties of pygmy seahorse are bargabants, which take on the color of the coral they live on. Although they may be hard to spot, once you do get a look at them, they're fascinating. I wonder what something that small thinks, or if it thinks at all. These small creatures may look cute, but they are deadly predators to copepods and can move at 500 times their body length in a second. <laughs> Brucesia micra Some adult male chameleons can reach up to two feet in length, but there is a tiny breed of dwarves that live on an island off Madagascar that are the size of the tip of a match. The Brucesia micra was only recently discovered, and I'm not surprised because they're only just visible to the human eye. The chameleons are active during the day but can be found sleeping on leaves at night. The minuscule reptile barely measures over an inch and is one of the smallest vertebrates on Earth. The chameleons are another example of island dwarfism and can only be found on the island of Nosihara. Some researchers believe that even smaller chameleons might exist. Right now, conservationists are trying to protect the reptiles from deforestation, leading to a loss of their habitat. Pygmy goats. Okay, we may have officially found the cutest dwarf animals in the world. If you didn't know about pygmy goats until today, well, you're welcome. Pygmy goats are a breed of miniature domestic goats that originate from the Cameroon Valley of West Africa. They now only exist in zoos and private properties in Europe and the United States, where some people keep them as pets. They are noted to be friendly and good-natured, and they look it from the videos I've seen of the animals. Pygmy goats are roughly a third of the size of a regular goat, measuring just 15 to 20 inches high and weights between 35 to 60 pounds. Like other goats, they can also produce milk, although they obviously yield much less. 
I came across a video of a whole bunch of pygmy goats in pajamas. There is zero context to this video. And you know what? Sometimes it's best to just not ask questions. Who makes pajamas for goats? Oh wait, I just remembered that we weren't asking questions. That was 10 unusual dwarf animals in the world. What do you think about this video? Let us know down in the comments. I always learn so much from making these videos, and I hope you find them just as educational at home. What dwarf animal did you like learning about the most? Don't forget to let us know if you think that that giraffe from the beginning of the video is real or not, and use the hashtag OpenDiscussion so we can see your comments.